Today we are starting the next step in this deck. Last year, if you remember, we built this deck as a family and now we are putting a privacy fence all along this area. We're partnering with the Home Depot and Olympic Maximum Stain to show you how easy this is to do a project like this. Mikey is here to help me. Mike also kind of panned out a lot of the um, mathematic things. And so we're gonna start by staining our boards. I'll also kind of show you a picture of all the things that we're using in case you wanna do this as well. Everything we've grabbed from the Home Depot and um, we're really excited to get this going. If you're thinking about doing an outdoor project, the Olympic Maximum Stain and Sealant is awesome for these projects. Number one, it's waterproofing and it offers like 4C and protection. So these boards are gonna last me all year long, especially in our snow that we get here. The pigment is gorgeous. We used Mystic Black and look how beautiful that stain looks. I really love the depthness of the color. And then it also has a fungal resistant finish, which is really great for when you're outside and you've got a lot of rain or snow like we do. The warranty is huge. You can see it here, 10 years on decks, 25 years on fences. And this is the other thing I love. You can apply it as low as 35 degrees Fahrenheit because it does get chilly where I live. So this was a really great option for me as well. And it's ready to go in 12 hours. Okay, you cannot go wrong with this stuff. So we put on these um, baseboards here. They're a one by eight, right Mikey? They're like an eight by eight square that we yeah. cut from a one by eight. They're about 10 inch by 10 inch. Oh, Mike says 10 inch by 10 inch. Mounted them into the framing underneath so it was extra strong. Mikey put in the brace. This is a four by four brace, right babe? Yeah. And now he's putting in the four by four that we already stained. Mm. Just like that. And then he'll just screw it in on all the sides. Here's some he's already done over here and over there. When you're installing these, it's super important to make sure things are level. Mikey helped me figure that out because do you see he's using the level here? Because if you just eyeball it, by the time you get to the end of here, you're gonna have crooked boards. So we're making, we're starting here at the bottom, first brackets to make sure those are level and then we'll base it off of that. So as we move down, it'll get a little bit taller at the end or higher up when we first install the first one, but at least it'll look good to the eye. Right, babe? Mm -hmm. Okay. So Mikey left and I'm on my own. And that always gets me a little nervous because um, I just, I'm like, what if I mess up? I still, like after five years of doing projects, I still get a little nervous and that's okay because I might mess up and that's okay because I just love to keep learning and growing. And so I'm staining the heck out of all these boards. I'm putting two coats on of stain or two layers of stain. Um, it's soaking in really, really nicely. I love this mystic black. I love this color. Um, so this is what he finished and where I need to pick up now. So he got the first wall done and I love it. So now it's my turn to do this part and he was sweet and left me this one leveled already so I can just add on each board. We're doing a half inch space and um, super professional. These are our spacers. Yeah, that's how we roll around here. <laughs> um, but I might, those boards are also a space the same distance. I'm trying to do it all by myself. I'm feeling proud. Mikey did that one. I did this one. And it worked. And it wasn't that hard.
Three down. One to go. Well, I gotta fix some of this, but. The back privacy fence is finished. I'm so happy with it. It was a really great budget DIY because we used the $5 cedar boards. And look how good it turned out. The stain is gorgeous. We used that mystic black. We got these plants at the Home Depot. You also have these darling lights, two for 25 from the Home Depot, which I added on each one of these. And they're solar powered, okay? So I don't have to do anything. And they came with the solar powered battery operated lights. So what a great space. Anyone can do this one. I promise you that.